Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Need for Speed Heat. Today is episode number 12, and we are here in the garage to do some performance upgrades. So, um, what we want to do, uh, is we want to get a set of, um, track suspension, probably. Uh, we want to make sure we've got super brakes, and we need a better set of tyres. Uh, race tires, track tires. That seems good. Uh, do we have? Yes, we have super. There we go. Uh, we're at two, two, two. Uh, we could probably squeeze a bit more out of this, to be honest. Let's see how much we can squeeze out of it. Two, three, two. We could swap it out for a different car and get so much more power out of it. That's the thing. Oh! Engine swaps. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, that's what we have anyways. Uh, they don't unlock for another rep level. Before we can get a V6 one. And they're expensive. Hmm. Right, let's go to the daytime anyways. Because we're going to go and do one of these missions that we needed to do for Anna. Um, we might see at the end of the episode. See whether we can buy a new car. Um, I don't even know how much money we've got now. We definitely burned a lot of it. Just then. Um, but we can transfer parts, which is really cool. Um, we can move them across from different vehicles. 92,000, that's alright. That's not as bad as I was expecting. Port Murphy. Let's head over there now. Flamingo. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Right, let's go. Oh, it's quicker. The new Sassane shot's still on the run. Yes, we know. Aren't you? The guy's seriously unhinged, and we took a massive dump on his life. If he's smart, he'll stay away. Smart isn't a word that comes to mind for this guy. Maybe Mercer took him for a little drive. Lots of gators in Granada Marsh. <laughs> I wonder what stupid tastes like. Oof. Just take out that car with that telephone pole. Oof. Let's put our action camera on for a bit. I don't know why it keeps swapping back to the normal camera. Need for speed, if you're watching this, change it. Make it so it saves the camera angle. Oof. Got it. If you just take out collectibles as you go past them, you actually earn quite a lot of them, surprisingly. Obviously, we're going to try and get all of the, um, like, flamingos and all that. We're going to try and get that customization, get, like, a customization video out or something. I mean, once we finish this game, 
I will put a poll out um, to see what cars people want to see. Uh, see which ones they want me to customise and all that. Because I really want to do, like, customization videos afterwards. Where we sort of customise a couple of cars in a video. Glad I let that go to voicemail. It was Jordan, and she's pissed. What did we do? Taking out Shaw's big news. It's all anyone's talking about. Spotlight's on us now. Let's make sure it stays there. Hell yeah. Hey, coming up on the right. What are we waiting for? Let's follow. Oh, we got a follow mission. Tech say anything about where we're tailing this cop to? Nope. Guess we we'll find out. Hopefully not die trying. I think he went into the container yard. Time and place? Know what I'm saying? I don't know about you, but this doesn't look like the type of place to hand out parking tickets. Easy! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop here. What are they doing? Looks like our boy just has some keys tossed to him. We go forward, they're gonna see us. Try backing up, go the way we came. Keep it together! Here we go, the cops coming past now. Out anything about Torres? Not much. Only she's part of Mercer's unit. They've been doing this shit for a while now. Just lately, it's gotten out of control. Maybe she's telling the truth. We'll see. Cops really don't have any interest. Money, status. Sounds familiar. <laughs> Try not to destroy everything. Keep it together. We are definitely causing suspicion. Easy. We need to be quiet. They'll spot us. Stopping at the lockup. Pull over and wait. Ooh. Cut scene. You take it as the stop. I think we're gonna need to put a foot down to follow this one. Oh, it's not a cut scene. I think I know the owner of this F40. You do? What happened? I think she got the same deal as me. If it gets impounded, then it vanishes. No records, nothing. Look at this asshole. Driving this thing like it's his. The owner ever reported? That goes missing, same as the car. It's our no tailgating now. Stay on track, come on! I'm trying! You can't lose him. This is a bumpy road. Yeah, this totally looks legit. Let's find out. Wow. 
What's going on here? The cars in here must be worth a fortune. I've raced against some of these. Full of money, big. That's not mother. Easy. What the hell? So much for getting your car back. Bastards. You should have seen his face last night when I loaded it on the truck. Thought he was gonna cry. Frank would have loved that. Okay, I'm with Taurus. Screw Mercer. This needs to stop. If we're doing this, we need a plan. We'll figure something out. Shit, there's some shit going down. There is some shit going down. Follow the law, complete it. Uh, what level are we? Rep level. Uh, we need to level up a little bit more, I think. Actually, if I go in here, does it add my rep on, or is that already added on? They're still not talking to me, which means it's pretty quiet in here. Uh, right, let's go back to the daytime, because there's a couple more races I want to do. Um... Because I actually want to buy a car at the end of this episode. Buy a new one. Because even though the Nissan is really cool. Um, the level that our parts are at. It's not quite high enough to get. Um, decent performance out of it. So I want to go buy a high end car. That we can then chuck all the super parts into it. Oh. is a clever idea though. Oof. I got you. Not quite 150. That's all right, though. Here 
Here we go. Recommended level 232. We managed to take on 260 before though. Um, and they were only... We were only like 210. Now that we're 232, we should be able to destroy them. Just try and rev the engine, just... Going slow at the start, but we will catch up. Well, you didn't move out of the way, so that's why I crashed into you. Oh, well, you're a bit stupid. This car is very race and on-road dependent. It's very focused for that task. The only way we're getting around this corner is a handbrake turn. That would be the only way to get around that corner. Street art nearby. Check that out later. We are destroying them right now. We're going to take down Mercer and his task force. Destroy it. Rip it up from the inside. Oh, wrong button. Well, I activated NOS by mistake. Whoa! The car fight back. It fights back like mad. One more lap. Let's go. One sixty three. I think that's the fastest we've gotten out of this car. Did we miss the checkpoint? No, we did not. We cut that corner like crazy, though. Take down. Take them all out. Let's go. I 
Let's not see how fast we can get. One forty two. Forty grand. That's a good paycheck. Uh, 164. Hmm. Very nice. Uh, we've got another event here. 260. Uh, that seems good. Not quite again. Ah, oh, the other truck got in the way. Why'd you stop in the middle of the road? Stupid thing. Here we go, circuit race. Marlin. Fair enough, 29,000 available. That gets us up to about 170. That should be plenty for a decent car. Riot Club from the last game. I think this is my new favourite game. I'm not even joking. Like, this is so much more fun than Forza ever was from start. This is just so much fun. I love this. And if they bring out updates like they did for Payback, like, every month. I think we might have done this event before already, um, but it's a leveled up one by the look of it. I think they upgrade the race like up 20 points or 40 points each time you do it. But obviously it unlocks the upgrade after a while as well, so it doesn't just give it you straight away, so it progresses. That is decent though. Oh, there's no knots. I want a knot. Be able to boost my way out of that. Here we go. Oh. 
Moss, moss. Get a drift in. These games are very simple as well. Like, to the point I could even play this with one hand. I'm playing with one hand right now. Okay, yeah, I may have gone out a little bit. But if I can play this with one hand, then anyone can pick this up and play this. No problem. See? It's just so easy to do. Like, I'm legit playing with one hand right now. It's easy. It's such an easy game mechanic to get used to, the driving, uh, for this game. Finish first. Okay, so we're here in the dealership. Uh, we're going to buy a new car. Um, let's see what cars we have towards the higher end. Oh, we got a BMW Z4. That's quite nice. And we got an M5. Oh, it's a GTR. But I know that's been overused, definitely, quite a lot. Um, we got the KS edition of the i8. Okay, we definitely don't have an... Oh, the Polestar! Nah, the Polestar! Oh, I forgot the Polestar was on there. Whew. Right, so my choice would either be the M5. What level is the M5? 242. 247. Uh, what is the potential horsepower? 1,089, whereas the M5 is 1,120. Mm. That's so difficult. But the difference in price it is, I'm going to go for the BMW for now. We'll go for that. Just because it's so much cheaper. This is quicker than the Nissan and any other car that I've driven yet. And it's not even upgraded. Anywhere near. At all. Whoa, 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 whoa. Collect. We've got a couple more of those to collect. What, where am I? How do I get out of this place? Enter the garage. Right, so what we're going to do, we're going to uh, quickly swap to the oh, Nissan. Bank. Sweet, ride. Sweet ride, I know. Uh, so we're going to swap into the Nissan, uh, and we are going to um, downgrade every single part. Uh, tires and stock suspension. Uh, there we go. Uh, let's swap out back to our BMW. To the Zim Zimmer. Zimmer Bimmer. Uh, I don't know what the difference between the two dual turbochargers are. 
Uh, let's head more towards um, track for now. Uh, we've got a radar disruptor. Uh, I've left the other part in the other car by mistake. That's got some power. Right, first of all, let's sort out a front bumper. That looks quite nice. I'm not going to lie. That's quite a nice front bumper. You know what? I want to try that. A split front splitter. Canards. Uh, mandatory. And I want to try chrome. Chrome would look quite nice, actually. Uh, there's the headlights. Uh, we'll leave the headlights for now. Ooh, those Speed Hunters fenders look nice. Uh, we can check them on. Uh, I'm going to put carbon mirrors on, because that'll look quite nice. Extended arches. Um, we have to have blacked out lights on the rear. Uh, big diffuser. Where's the exhaust? There we go. I never thought I'd say this, but I prefer the stock exhaust. Like, I never thought I would have to say that I prefer stock parts. No, give me... Oh, it's all capitals anyways. Why was I trying to do caps? Tiny little things. Got a nice Voltec here. That looks quite nice. Uh, let's check that on. Um, wheels. Let's actually do some wheel stuff. Uh, I'm sticking with stock tyres for now. Those are some nice BBS rims. Uh, we're going to go for some bright red Brembo rims. Uh, not rims. Um, brakes. Uh, and let's swap these over. Rims. I thought I couldn't change them then. I was like, what on earth? Uh, calipers. Actually, did I put that one on or the other one? Calipers. I think I put this one on. Let's go for that one. Right, uh, wraps. Let's take a look. Go online. Yes. Let's establish a connection again. Hopefully. Ugh, oh, synchronizing. No, this is a nightmare. Just connect, please. There we go. Oh, what is this? Whoo! That looks pretty cool. I like that. What's this?
That's nice as well, just plain and simple. Let's go for that one. Um, which means I can then go to here. Chuck on blacked out headlights. And then we can start talking about NOS. We'll put blue NOS. Uh, blue tire smoke, because the car's blue again. And this time we can put a dark blue underglow. Um, I'm going to take the air suspension out of the other car. Um, and sort that out. But, let's take it for a little test drive for now. Oh, that looks stunning. We just made that beast of a car. Oh, this is quick. Ah, oh, look at that. And we got the billboard with the little jump. Perfect. Let's see what our top speed is. What we can get. We are going uphill right now. Oh, that wasn't good. Let's try the opposite direction. Let's see what we can get going this way. Well, we definitely don't have a limiter on this car. So we're hitting 178, 179, 180, yes, 180 miles an hour. Woo! There we go. 180 miles an hour we hit with this car. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. And if you want to help support the channel, Hit that join button, it would mean the world to me. Um, join the Mech Tech crew on here. Uh, I want to see what kind of cars you guys have built. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.